My name is Catherine Moonan. I'm here as the pitch coach on Dragon's Den. To make your pitch much more interesting, you've got a high, a middle and a low. So every time you move on to a new point, lift your voice at the start of a sentence and try to avoid dropping your voice at the end of sentences. Quite often, people tend to fall into that habit. And quite often, the punchline tends to be at the end of the sentence. Therefore, people miss the punchline. We also need to vary the pace of our voice. So obviously, if it's something quite complicated, you can slow it down a little bit. If it's something that you think the dragons are familiar with, you can speed it up a little bit. But it's all about that variety and not to be afraid, of course, to pause. That split second pause allows those listening to take in what you've just said and it also allows you for that split second to think about what you're going to say next. And one of the main things is to avoid what we call gap fillers. So the M and R that people could end up, could end up counting the number of times you actually say it as opposed to listening to what it is that you're saying.